What's going on, everybody out there? This is Popular Stranger, and we are back at you again today for another Mutt 17 player card review. Today, we are going over Ultimate Legend Willie Brown. Now, this card has three different versions that we will discuss in depth over the gameplay that will be coming up in a moment on the video, so stay tuned for that. But this card is a 97 overall with pick specialists, Deep defender and edge setter chemistry. Edge setter, very unique for a cornerback. So let's go ahead and take a look at his stats. Again, 97 overall without the boost. 6 foot 1, 93 speed, 94 acceleration, 90 agility, 94 man coverage, 92 zone coverage, 85 press coverage, 93 play recognition, and 74 catching. We're going to scroll through the rest of his stats before we jump on into this gameplay. Let me know what other cornerbacks you'd like to see me review coming up in future videos. We will definitely have the positional hero Richard Sherman review coming up this week, probably within the next day or two, so stay tuned for that. But again, let's go ahead and see what this Willie Brown card can do on the field. So we'll start things out by going over the pricing on all three of his cards. First up is the set version, which has pick specialist, deep defender, and edge setter chemistries. On Xbox One, about 505k. On the PlayStation 4, about 500k even. The milestone version, which all gameplay you're watching is coming from that, gives you the pick special and edge setter chemistries in deep defender times two. That one is very similar in price at 510k on Xbox and PlayStation 4, 510k as well. So if you are going to pick up this card and you want the 97 overall version, just pick up the milestone with the deep defender times two. It's probably going to bump you up to a 98 right away. The boss version, which is a 98 overall card and has the same chemistries as the set version, 630k on Xbox One and 720k on on the PlayStation 4. Mutthead.com rates him as a 94 overall man coverage corner, 94 zone, 85 jump ball, 94 range, 94 in run support, and 90 physical. He's rated the 12th overall shutdown corner, the number 15th overall man coverage corner, number 19th overall zone corner, number 6 nickel corner, and number 12 in run support. So fully chemmed up with the three chemistries, again, deep defender, pick specialist, and edge setter. He will obviously go to a 99 overall, and I had him that for most of the gameplay that you're watching as well. The only one that I eventually took away was the edge setter chemistry, which I don't think really makes a huge difference uh, as far as his stats, though he is a very, very good run supporter. He can come up and play the run. He lays big hits. He forces a lot of fumbles for me, which is one thing that I really do like about this card. Just very, very physical. So, fully chemmed up. He has a 94 zone, 94 man, 97 jumping, 97 play rec and 94 speed really really good fully chemmed up the boss version is going to give you 95 speed so that helps you know running downfield with some of the speedier wide receivers for the most part though i was unimpressed with this card the big selling point on it honestly was just the chemistries that fit what i was running on defense and the fact that i could get him to a 99 overall kind of helped um at cb number one he made not much impact at all he really turned things around when i moved him over to cb number two and put sherman at one that's when i actually noticed a difference the one thing i would say that's good about him is when he gets interception he gets some really good animations one-handed catches tough catches in traffic so when he does do that you know it is very helpful he sometimes has some brain farts where the ball will just go right over his head and he doesn't react but all in all i'd probably say there's better options out there when you look at his cost. 